Hi, this is Dr. Ramu, CEO, Career Development Center, Narsimharad Engineering College, Hyderabad. Today I came with most awaited event, TCS Core Vita Season 13. Last 12 seasons, this event grown very big. Every year, the lakhs of people are going to participate this event because this event, the TCS going to offer not only prize money, including job offers and internships. The first year to final year, any students means the students who are going to pass out from 26, 27, 28, 29 means current first years to final years, anyone can participate in this event. Here, the main motto behind this event is to identify the top coders. This is a 24 hours hackathon, but they are going to give the six hours to you. In the six hours, you need to solve the six problems. The most important point here is the plagiarism. The people who are going to fall into the plagiarism, they are going to disqualify. That's why, so the code of honor is very important. To achieve this, so you just participate in the Code Chef contest. Every week there is a Code Chef contest is there on the Wednesday. You just participate for the next two to three months. Definitely you are going to crack the exam. And please remember, the people who are going to solve one or two problems in the TCS code beta, definitely they are going to qualify, qualify into the TCS code beta first round. After the first round, the second round is there. They are going to identify the second round is a super coders. Based on the second round result, they are going to offer the various packages from the 3.5 lakhs to 9 lakhs. TCS Ninja, TCS Digital, TCS Prime. These are the three packages they are going to offer based on the performance in the TCS code beta. But last from the 12th season onwards, they introduce one more concept. The people who got shortlisted in the TCS code beta, again, they have to write the test in the TCS science centers. This is their included for the means earlier. So people who clear the TCS code beta, they will get a direct pre-placement offer. But here, the people who shortlisted in the TCS code beta, and again, they have to participate in the TCS ion centers. Now, I am going to show you the step by step process how to register in the, for the TCS code beta and also I am going to show you a sample certificate I mean rank card right after clearing of TCS code beta they are going to send to the rank card this rank card will give the more weightage for your resume now I am going to explain the TCS code beta registration process okay now this is the home page of the TCS code beta season 13 here codevita.tcsapps.com If you open this website, this is the home page. Here, the two options are there here. Login, register. So, if you click on the register, this is the page is going to open. Now, I am going to show you the registration process one by one. Before going to the TCS Codevita registration, there is a two steps are there in the registration process. The first one is the to create the TCS ID, reference ID, and the next part is TCS code beta registration. So what is the need of the TCS ID? See, the people who are going to aim for the job, they should create the TCS ID. Based on this only, they are going to consider for the recruitment. And the next step is a TCS code beta registration. Right? So how to create this TCS ID reference? So we simply click on the website nextstep.tcs.com. If you open this, so you will get this is the page. This page will appear. Right? Here when you click on the register, then here you have a two options are there. IT and BPS. Here you can choose the IT. After the IT, right? Here you need to enter your email ID. Preferably use your domain email ID for the easy access right after that you can provide your OTP which they are going to send to the your email ID next right so the, the steps are there you just follow the steps as it is once finish the steps all these steps I will share this document in the link as well right after this you will get the TCS ID reference ID here this is the TCS reference ID have you observed DT2024 
right? 9702.71. This is the TCS reference ID. Here, or once you create the TCS ID, next step is to create the TCS Code Beta account. So once you enter into the TCS Code Beta Season 13, you just click on the register button. This is the form. You just enter all the details and click register. Then the accept the terms and conditions followed by you will get a email verification once you've done that here in future no need to wait for the OTP this is the Microsoft Authenticator is there by using the Microsoft Authenticator you're going to log into the respective TCS portal so when you scan this one so you will get a page like this this is your OTP it's going to change for every 30 seconds once you enter into the OTP, the page is going to accept. And when OTP is received to the mobile number, once you complete all these details, then this page is going to create. Have you observed that? Here the one thing is the CTR DT reference ID. What it means that the which you created in the TCS next step. There you're going to use the use the that ID here. You just enter the ID here. And one more thing, as per the TCS India Recruitment Guidelines, participants clearing the TCS code with round 1 and interested to job opportunities with the TCS India would be required to appear on an in-center assessment. I explained already, right? The people who are aiming for the job, they should once finish this TCS code with exam, again, you need to participate in the IAN centers, then you'll get a pre-placement offer, okay? Now, I am going to show you the sample certificate. Season 12. This certificate is awarded to the Anusha, right? So, she is a last year student. So, securing the 8,572 rank means even they are going to mention the rank also on season. This certificate is going to give the more weightage to the resume as well. So, only one thing you have to remember to crack the TCS code beta, you people should practice the coding. Well, who wants to clear the TCS code beta, they should participate in the course chef contest every Wednesday. And who, the people who are going to solve three to four problems, definitely they are going to crack the TCS code beta with good rank. Only one thing remember the code of honor. Don't share your code with anyone, right? Maintain the code of honor. If the fall into the plagiarism, definitely you're going to disqualify. All the best for your TCS code beta season 13. Thank you.